First at five, police are still looking for a suspect after they say a 62 year old man was stabbed to death in an Atlanta neighborhood. Thanks so much for being with us this evening. I'm Faith Jesse and I'm Jonathan Martin in tonight for Jennifer Bellamy. 11 Alive's Molly Oak is live for us tonight and Molly. I know neighbors are telling you they are certainly not used to seeing police lights on their street. Yeah, people who live along Stonewall Drive Southeast say they've never seen something like this happen on their street. Now neighbors say they're scared because police are still looking for the suspect. If neighbors could pick one word to describe this street. Quiet. They're not used to seeing crime scene tape here. Pretty nice neighborhood. I've never, uh, you know, it's nothing like that it never happened over here. If you do see the officers here, you really see them because people run the stop sign. It's just quiet, it looks the way it looks. Last night, Stonewall Drive was anything but silent, with police, canines, and investigators after Atlanta police say an argument escalated, leaving a man stabbed to death around 11 p.m. Like two, three, four houses down. One neighbor who didn't want to be on camera has lived here. Five years, never heard a shooting, never heard a gunshot, nothing. No break-ins, no car break-ins, none of that. McGarrick Harmon agrees, saying he's lived here 30 years and hasn't seen something like this in decades. Not really. It don't, don't really be crime over here. It used to be a long time ago, like 20 years ago, but it's changed now, so it's really quiet. According to APD's crime map, since the beginning of the year, this is the only murder in this neighborhood. If you add in aggravated assault and simple assault, the victim count goes to 10 for all of 2023. Even if you expand the search to the neighborhood next door, it only has seven simple assaults for the year, no reported murders or aggravated assaults. No a lot of crimes, no a lot of shooting or not, none of that. Like the stabbing was just off, really, I was like, oh wow, I'm scared now because it's close. A major crime hitting too close to home. We're still working to learn who that victim is. Meanwhile, police say they're still investigating. If you have any information, give them a call. Reporting live in Atlanta, Molly Oak, 11 Alive News. All right, Molly, thank you so much for that update.